Orchard Park is the site for this NFC East versus AFC East matchup between the Eagles and the Bills. What a matchup we have at wide receiver today. Two of the biggest threats in the NFL who love to cause chaos for opposing defenses. How about this matchup, Phil? Yeah, you know, it's interesting. When you have uh, speedy wide receivers, what you have to do, you got to make sure your safeties are smart, they're talented. Both teams have that because it is easy in this game nowadays to get the football to the wide receivers. If they can't get open down the field, just throw them some screens on the outside and dare the defense to tackle it. That'll be a touchback, and the ball will be placed at the 20. The Bills come out in the pistol. The quarterback motions the wide receiver. Now first and ten. The give to the running back. He's got some daylight. No one's going to get him now. The 40. And they're really setting the tone here early with the big running play that time. They took advantage, Jim, of a defense that's out of position. Nice job by the running back taking advantage of it, and he picks up big yards. The offense back to the line of scrimmage after going for more than 40 yards on the previous play. And he'll try it left. And for about six, imposing their will early on the defense with a solid effort on the ground. And we talk so much, don't we, about the passing game in the NFL, but it's still about who can out hit the other one. And right now, the offense, they are winning that battle. Nice run. And he's forced to the ground. We're early in this one, but already a crucial third and long play coming up. Uh, these are tough situations. What are you going to do on the offensive side? There's only so much you can do. If I was the defense, I would look for a screen. Ohio! Ohio! Spillers lined up in a single back formation. Third and 12. Looking long. Kerry Williams has the pick. That brings the play to an end. Nothing worse than, as a quarterback to throw an interception early in the game. And you just got to make sure you go over the, to the bench, you talk to yourself, keep your confidence up, and keep attacking. Foles takes a look Let's now go. from under center. First and ten, LaShawn McCoy takes the handoff. He's stacked up at that point. When a coach can have a run, it picks up those kind of yards. It gives them confidence, and they will show more and more patience with the running game. So the defense, they better dig in here. Second down and four. McCoy now makes the move to the right. Two tight ends on the field here. Play action fake, looking to throw. And he's intercepted. Give a lot of credit to the defense this time. They got the offense backed up. It's inside its own 20. They're aggressive, and being aggressive gives them a chance to get the interception, and they make it. Nice play. The defense comes out of the nickel. First and ten. Looking for an open receiver on the right. What a hit, and the ball falls incomplete. That's interesting. As you watch the receiver trying to make that catch, he knew the defender was close, so he didn't put all of his heart into it. The defender made a nice hit and knocks the football out to the ground. Nickel formation here for the defense. And second and ten. Intercepted. That'll stop the play right there. What a terrible job by the quarterback. But nobody's open, tries to force the pass, and look, what's it turn into? An interception.
double tight end formation. First and 10. McCoy's taking the handoff. The defense, when they have you backed up against your own end zone, they're expecting you to run the football. They were ready, and they stopped the team for a short game. This will be second down. Out of the eye, they give it to the tailback. Fakes them out and gains about one. The defense looking for one more stop here on third down after that run. Here's the give to LaShawn McCoy. They bring him to the turf. Nice run that time by the running back, and if they keep running the football like this, it's just a matter of time before they fake it and throw that football over the top of the defense. They are being physical, the running back doing a good job, and they are making it happen in the running game today. First and 10, another handoff. Now cutting to the right side, looking for some open space. Good run that time. It results in a first down, and it moves those chains on the sideline. Keep those chains moving. Hire that defense out. First and 10. He gets it again on this drive. Picks up about two. Foles takes a look now from under center. Second down and nine. They beat him the ball again. Has the first down. Now looking for more. LaShawn McCoy with a nice piece of running on that play. Good job by the running back that time. Finding the open hole and picking up those extra yards. Let's see what they do on first down following that huge play. They'll run it with him again. They bring him down at the 29-yard line. What that run does, it just puts the offense in a good situation. So a good, positive run. And it'll be second down and six after the running play on first down. And that will close out the first quarter in Orchard Park, New York. We'll return in just a moment. We're back here in this low-scoring affair. They bring in the extra tight end. And the second quarter is underway with this snap. Great job by the receiver that time, holding on to the football after the catch. What a hit by the defense. In this league, you better be able to catch it and take the big hit. Foles takes a look now from under center. They're going back up top the throw to the left. He had it, but the hit jars the ball loose. Well, they always say if you get your hands on the football, you got to make the catch. Yeah, right. The guy that made that rule up wasn't getting hit as he was trying to catch the football. Nice hit that time by the defender. The defensive captain looks over and signals an immediate timeout. This long drive continues. Second and 10, going off tackle here. He's headed right. Nice job that time by the offense, getting the first down inside the red zone. And it's a good thing they got a quarterback with a strong arm because you got to throw into some tight spots in the red zone. This has been a long drive so far. Yeah. 
first and goal. Will stay on the ground, takes it across, and he's in for the touchdown. That was just an awful job, wasn't it, by the defense? I mean, it's first and goal. Well, you know it's going to be a run, or I think you should be playing run. The defense not ready. They get overpowered, and they give up the running touchdown. The Bills are ready to return the kickoff. He's a dangerous returner, and he'll have a chance to show you right here. And the tackle's made right around the 25-yard line. Ohio! Ohio! Spillers lined up directly behind the quarterback here. First and 10 to the ground here. And they're gonna run it right. Steps out of bounds. Good job that time by the running back. I'm sure he's a little winded after that play. He showed that speed getting out there and picking up those extra yards. The Bills will approach this play from out of the pistol. First down and 10. Left side. And D'Amico Ryans makes the tackle. Always good to have these types of runs. Yeah, it's not a first down. But it sends a message. It shows everybody that you can run it when you want to. And also, it opens up so many other things for your offense. To the right side. The Bills will go with the pistol on this play. The wide receiver shifting around in motion. Way through the second quarter run it again left side and he's going to be tackled and that's going to bring us to fourth down this defense you're playing against they're pretty good so it's fourth down near midfield punt the football Spillers lined up as the single back on the spot when you play man-to-man -man against this receiver, you're going to have a tough time. Quarterback's a good thrower. Really hard for a defensive back to stay with him. First down here after the completion. Here's the give to Fred Jackson. A lot of ways to get plays in the NFL. It doesn't always have to be by a pass. Good job that time by the running back. They're able to move the chains after that last run. Gets it again here. Well, if you're a good running back, when there's not a lot there, you find a way to make some extra yards. Here in the red zone, it's even more important. Ohio! Ohio! Second down now. They feed it to him again. To the right side, count it, touchdown. Good job by the offense. They get in there, they tie this game up. Now we'll see if the defense can take advantage of that momentum and keep it on their side. But a flag is in there. He made it. Defense. The penalty is declined. That last play will hold up. Dan Carpenter readying his team for the kickoff. And he runs it out to about the 27 before he's taken down. Foles takes a look now from under center. First and ten. McCoy is going to take the handoff now. Going to take it the distance. And he's out of bounds. You know, when the linebackers, when they see that the offensive formation is shifted to one side, 
Well, as a linebacker, you've got to play to that strong side and try to get up there and stop the run. New set of downs now after picking up the first on the ground. Working that left side. That catch will extend the drive. Good job that time by the quarterback. Man-to-man -man coverage down the field. When you see it, you've got to be accurate with the football. He was that time, and that's why we got the completion. They've got a first down now after that catch. McCoy's got it on the handoff. The tackle is made. Offense lines up here. Second down and five. Another carry here. Good coaching on the defensive side. Everybody stays at home. They stay in their gap, and they hold that run to a short game. Foles takes a look now from under center. Foles has still got the football after the play fake. Balls picked off. It's away from the stack. As good as it gets. Touchdown. Well, when you study the offense and you know what they're going to do, you're able to make plays like that. You time the interception perfectly, you make the catch, and you take it all the way back for the score. The Bills with the PAT to come. And it's a fake. Looking across the middle, that's an interception. They will not find a way into the end zone, so they'll only get six points out of the trip. Bills ready to boot this one down the field. Tackle just past the 20. We'll mark it at the 22-yard line. Coopers, a receiver Let's in go. the slot. First and ten. Incompletion on that hurried throw. The Eagles call a timeout. They're first. Jackson's lined up in the slot. Nick Bowles from the shotgun. Wide open. A foot race to the end zone. The 30, the 20, the 10. What an effort and a touchdown. What a terrible job by the defense. That time, nobody even covers the receiver. He is wide open down the field, and hey, nice job by the quarterback going through his progression. He finds the open guy and gets a touchdown pass. Add the extra point, the kick is good. Alex Henry ready for the kickoff. They'll take it at the 20. This will be the last play before halftime. First and ten. Up the middle. Here's the quick toss. Has the first down and a whole lot more. How impressive was that by Spiller? 
So that's going to do it for the first half. Eagles are up in this one. We're back here now in this one where the Eagles lead by one. Time to check in quickly with Danielle Bellini from the sidelines. Danny? I had a moment to quickly speak with Coach Marone during halftime. It's an uphill battle for his team guys as they head into the second half, but he says it's not the time to get frustrated. There's no reason to try and be a hero. Just follow the game plan and things will work themselves out. I'll send it back up to you guys. Thanks, Danielle, and now we'll go to the field. Foles takes a look now from under center. The third quarter begins with this play. Game of six. Well, that was a nice run that time off tackle. And listen, this is a bread and butter play in the NFL. It's about power running. Can your offensive tackle make the block to free up that running back so he has a chance to get in that secondary and make a nice run out of it? For this play, they'll Let's go, go with two team. tight ends. It's a second and four. McCoy's handed the football. Wide to the left. There's the tackle, but still, it's enough for the first down. Well, the defense, they give up a first down there. They're behind. They just can't sit back there and keep bending. You got to take some chances, go on the offensive, on the defensive side, and just make things happen. 